Hello, Mr. Holtz class. Today we are going to learn how to estimate weight using customary measurement. We're going to be using ounces and pounds. Let's go ahead and get started. First, we're going to go over some vocabulary. Estimate. To find a value that is close enough to the right answer, usually with some thought or calculation involved. Always remember, Estimate before you add, subtract, multiply, or divide. This makes doing any of those operations a lot easier. Customary units. The customary system of measurement is defined as a set of weights and measures used for measuring length, weight, capacity, and temperature, also known as the U.S. customary system. The customary units we are going to be learning about are length, which is distance, how far from end to end, or from one point to another. We measure that in inches, feet, and yards. Today, we are going to be learning about weight, how heavy something is. We are going to be using ounces, pounds, and tons. And for today's lesson, we're just going to stick to ounces and pounds, and we are not going to use tons. Another customary unit is capacity, the amount that something can hold, cups, pints, quarts, and gallons. Let's go ahead and start practicing. All of these items are measured in ounces. All of these items are less than 16 ounces. That is important to remember. A piece of paper, a lollipop, a fork, and a pen. We measure all four of those in ounces. If they weighed 16 ounces, they would be measured in pounds because 16 ounces equals one pound. So a paper, lollipop, fork, and a pen, we would measure those in ounces. All of these items are measured in pounds. All of these items are 16 ounces or more. A clothes dresser, a brick, a TV, and a bike. Since they weigh 16 ounces or more, we use pounds to measure them. Let's practice. Remember, one ounce is about the weight of a battery. One pound is about the weight of a small bottle of soda. What customary weight unit would we most likely use to measure this object? A strawberry. Would we use ounces or pounds? Correct answer is ounces. What about this object? A skateboard. Would we measure this in ounces or pounds? Correct answer is pounds. How about this object? A pair of scissors. Would we measure this in ounces or pounds? Ounces. Let's remember, estimate is to find a value that is close enough to the right answer, usually with some thought or calculation involved. Remember, we are always going to estimate before you add, subtract, multiply, or divide. It makes doing adding, subtracting, multiplying, or dividing much easier. Weight is how heavy something is. We use ounces, pounds, and tons. Remember, one ounce is about the weight of a battery, and one pound is about the weight of a small bottle of soda. Hopefully you learned something in today's lesson. Good luck and see you next time.